On the 2nd of May, at 4.30 in the morning, I woke up feeling a tightening pain in my chest, like I was in a vice. Together with this, I felt a burning pain in the inside of my chest bone. The EMS came very quickly, within five to seven minutes. When we came, we immediately recorded the ECG and saw that it was a heart attack. We sent this ECG to a heart center using STEMI technology. The cardiologist contacted us and talked to our doctor. He confirmed the heart attack and indicated the treatment. Myocardial infarction is a serious illness. What it basically means is that the coronary artery on the heart is blocked and the heart doesn't get enough oxygen. This represents an imminent threat to the life of a patient. According to the guidelines, we should open the artery within 90 minutes from the establishment of the diagnosis. And this is not that simple. This procedure can only be performed in specialized heart centers. Our analysis has shown that in the past, we've only managed to do this in about 40% of the cases in Slovakia. However, this problem is not exclusively Slovak. We find it all across Western Europe, the United States, and everywhere. Time is crucial. The later the artery is open, the bigger the damage to the heart, and the chances for the survival of the patient are smaller. Sending the ECG record to a heart center through STEMI technology helps us, especially in cases when we are uncertain about the myocardial infarction diagnosis. This is a beautiful illustration of how we were able to consult the ECG of a patient who is relatively distant in a different city. With the help of telemedicine, we were able to confirm the diagnosis remotely. As a result, the patient was directly and immediately transported to the cath lab. And while they were still on their way, our hospital team was getting ready to be able to start the procedure immediately. So in this case, it was within about 70 minutes that the procedure was performed. In the scenario in which the EMS would come and record the ECG, then transport me to the nearest local hospital for perhaps another ECG recording and a diagnosis confirmation, the time would be lengthened. But because the specialist decided right away that I have to undergo the procedure immediately, the time was shortened, maybe even by an hour. This may sound like a rare occurrence, but the fact is that today we consult such cases remotely through STEMI technology or smartphone telemedicine on a daily basis. In reality, there are about 300 consultations between paramedics on the field and specialists in heart centers each month in Slovakia. When you watch a movie, you may see the ideal situation the arrival of the EMS, transport to the hospital, and the performance of the surgery. So it was in my case. It's thanks to the contribution of STEMI technology that I'm still here today. It's not only about surviving the heart attack and the procedure. Many times it is about how damaged the heart muscle is when the patient leaves the hospital. And this influences quality of life in the future. Therefore, when we battle against time, it is not only so that the patient survives, but also we fight for the quality of their lives in the future.